Ah, the Rust Gas Station. One of the most hostile monuments on Fresh White. And I'm, well, I'm going to be stuck here for one week. I'm going to find out just how much progress a solo player can make. With hundreds of nakeds running around, Eokas going off everywhere, this is going to be a nightmare. The time was 1pm and I joined an 800 player server shortly after Fresh Wipe. Alright, let's start day number one. I'm going to make my way directly to Oxum's gas station. It is right here. Okay, we're actually not that far away, which is good. Uh, I am playing on an 800 pop server, so... <laughs> I don't know. Pain. Misery. Yep. We're about to do this. Let me just prove to you. Look, 783 out of 800 players. So it is very, very full. My first goal is to at least get a bag down next to Oxum's gas station. That is that is all I need to do. And then I will have completed my first goal. Uh, I'm only allowed to loot from inside the gas station. Uh, like this square... Is kind of all I'm allowed to loot. So I need to somehow get some cloth from that square. And then place a bag somewhere around there. Uh, and this gas station is right next to Outpost as well. Which probably means it's going to be one of the busiest gas stations. Okay, I think my tactic is I'm just going to have to wait. I'm going to have to wait until someone else dies. And then sneak in and try and rob the body or something. Oh. Oh. Oh no. No. <laughs> God, I hate gas station. These barrels, this must be it, right? These have to give me some cloth. <gasps> Come up. Okay, let's go. Run. Oh, there's someone on top. One pack. Please just let me place a bag. Ah. No. <laughs> Oh, he's got a rock. Okay. Oh, I just need to place a bag down, please. 18 seconds. Okay, so you can't place bags in uh, monuments. So the closest best thing I'm going to be able to do is just place a bag outside. Like here somewhere. Seven seconds. <sighs> please. <laughs> this has been... How long have we recorded? Probably about half an hour just to get a bag down. We have a bag. Let's go. And we can make a stash. We can make two. Oh, huge. And we're in the grid. We're technically in the grid. So that's good. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, we have a bag now. That is huge, man. Now we just need to play the waiting game and just pray. These crates spawn so fast on this server. It's like every four minutes or so. Oh, bro. Do you have a weapon? No weapon? Okay, we've got a gear set. I might try and I might just go hide that gear set. Well, like not a gear set, but you know, like uh <laughs> It's something. You could say day one was going off to a fantastic start. With only one bag in the area, I had to wait five minutes every time I wanted to respawn. But with my first goal done of getting a sleeping bag, it's now time to focus on goal number two. Build a small wooden shack just outside of the building block zone. <gasps> did this did someone break this? Oh, I need to get a door. I need a door. I need a door. If I could take that, that'd be huge. Someone broke the TC. What? Make a door, make a door and a lock. Yes. This is so big. Okay, door. Key lock, 10 seconds. We could actually have a base. That'd be huge. That's so big. Come on. Ah! Two, one. Oh! Oh, we have a base. Oh, I need to get a TC. Oh, my. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I can't believe we got this. <laughs> Comes with a free campfire as well. Yeah, buddy. All right. Let's go. Now we can actually start gathering loot and put it in our base. Dude. Oh, oh. <laughs> what? In no way. There's no way I just got a bed. Yo. Actual. Oh, what happened to my voice? Actual home. Yeah, baby. Yeah. That's shortened my respawn time to a minute. That's so big. 
Ah, uh, let me farm a tool cupboard before this base decays into nothing. I'm literally just going to farm one tree at a time. Like, I think that's the only way to do this. One tree at a time. Ah, oh, I finally got enough wood for a tool cupboard. That's big. Uh, I need a second door to make an airlock, which is going to be very useful so we don't get deeped on. Oh, we could put this down. Yeah, make it homely. That does not light up anything. <laughs> that is awful. <laughs> okay, TC going down. All right, let's do it. Yeah, baby. We have five hours upkeep. Nice. And a lock crafting. Okay, once that lock's done, uh, once this door is done, I'm going to literally just farm every single box because they spawn so quickly. I could probably get 50 scrap quite soon. And if we could start making nail guns, we could probably absolutely dominate this uh, this grid. So we need, we need wood and metal frags. As the night drew in on day number one, I made a little bit of progress that I was proud of. I got super lucky with finding a base that was already pre-made for me, and we managed to secure our loot inside. The next step was trying to find enough stuff so I could actually craft weapons for myself. So with day number two just on the horizon, it was time to get back out and fight. Ah, day number two is upon us. Uh, I don't think I can craft anything though. All right, we need the second door. Um, which is going to be pretty hard to get because it's just so many players. I need another 350 wood. These are the only trees that I could actually farm. That guy over there keeps killing me. So, yeah, these are the trees that I can farm for wood. Let's get a second door so we don't get door camped. Having an airlock is actually so good right now. Okay, I'm going to start looting uh, the crates, I think. The ones that respawn every four minutes. We have got quite a lot of scrap here. If you think about it, we've got that po that um, little, whatever they're called, substations. That one and that one over there, because they're all in the grid. Well, only half of that one over there, but they're all in the grid. So we have all of them to loot. And inside gas station, if we're feeling extra brave. Another battery? What? Let's go. Man, day number two is going off to our fly start. 148 metal frags? Dude. I can get some wood. I can make any ochre. Won't be long before I'm crafting crossbows and nail guns. We just gotta be patient. DB, DB. Oh, spring. Come on. Do we have enough scrap for a tier one? We just need the wood. We have enough metal? We, yeah, we do. We just need 500 wood. Let me make a tier one workbench. That'll be absolutely massive. Come on, we need 500 wood. It's not that much. I think it's like two or three trees. Oh, crap. Oh, leave me alone. God. <laughs> oh, you picked me up. Oh, wood. Oh, paddle. Uh, I help you. Thank you. Thank you. What a nice guy. I just need a little bit of wood, dude. Give me the paddle. He took my wood. Come on. Yeah, we made it home with 500 wood. All right, let's craft a tier one. That is, oh, what a lovely sight. A tier one workbench. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Day number two. That's not too bad. It's not too bad. Workbench going down. Oh, yeah. Okay, nice. That means we can craft uh, Yoko. I mean, I can craft nail gun, but I don't think I have enough metal fragments or scrap yet. Uh, I kind of want to do a recycle run, but I don't want to do that a die. But well, I've got no choice. <laughs> Come on, Jadis. We could do this. Grab the paddle, baby. Oh. Oh. 
to be out. Go. Go. Oh. The paddle play. <laughs> yeah. Come on. we got to get this home. Yeah, there we go. Nice. All right. What do we get? Oh, 31 scrap. Nice, dude. Is that, oh, that's enough for a nail gun, I think. <gasps> that's a food. Oh, spoiled. I am spoiled today. What a good day. Day number two is a good day. I think we can make a nail gun. <sighs> yeah, baby. An extra sword. A hatchet and a bow. Dude. Okay, I'm going to craft the Twitch Rivals trophy. Uh, just to give me 100% comfort. So hopefully I can heal up to 100 HP. Okay, I'm going to go to the front of the gas station. There's a road, I think. Oh, there's a crate there. Let's get that. Oh. My team, my team. Ah. Oh. My team. My team, my team, my team. Okay. Pick, 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 pick. Double button, double button, double button. Please, 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 please. I'm scared. I'm taking a scrap. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm taking a scrap. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs> I took a scrap. <laughs> I had some stone, I think. Yeah. I can't get any stone. I don't want to like make too many enemies, you know? If I can if I can have some friends, I think that might help me in the long run. Just for now, anyway. I've got a thousand stone. That's kind of big. If I get some low grade, I'll make a furnace. Uh, I can't make any more. I'm going to have to do a recycle run. Hey, can I recycle? Hey, hey, hey. It's me, me, me. Well, I'll be in. Uh, oh, you recycle. I'm okay. from Russia. I wait. I, I wait. Don't know. I'll wait. Yeah, I'm from Russia. Okay, we got some, we got some friends. He just left his friend. Oh, oh come on, bro. He started still. Ah. <laughs> Run. Uh, can you mean invite, 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 party, invite, party, invite, oh, party. Okay. So. He said run. Why did he say run? Okay, I guess I'm in a team now. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Well, I guess I'm in a team just so we don't kill each other. Um, That's kind of nice, I guess. Oh, they are some geared guys up there. I need some cloth, really, don't I? Okay, I'm gonna loot the crates, I think. Um, oh, I can't go around that corner. What's this guy doing? Holy crap, the gear guys are coming. What is happening? <laughs> help, 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 help. What? what? Get out of the way. Who are these guys? What oh. the hell? <laughs> I, just... I hate gas station, man. <laughs> Who's the guy with the P2? During day two, I got so focused with the PvP that I kind of lost track of what we were doing. So to get back on track, I made myself a list. Step number one was to get a sheet metal door so that we wouldn't get flame raided instantly. Step number two was to stone or metal the inner one by one of the base. And step number three was to acquire as much scrap as possible to go down the tier one workbench. I figured if I could get to compound bow, my life would be a lot easier. All right, I need to get a sheet metal door. That's like... Priority number one right now. Uh, how much metal do I have? I need. I think I need like 50. Door, double door is... Yeah, I need 50 metal frags. Which doesn't sound like a lot. But it could be in this server. It very much well could be. That's 50 metal frags right there. Okay, I think that's enough for sheet belt door. Can I get yep. So sheet belt door. Nice. 
Nice. Okay, that's good. Now we just need to stone or metal up this part of the base. I don't think a thousand's enough, but we'll get our stuff with brick. Yeah, 150 for that. Do the foundation. Yeah, not quite. Okay, we need a little bit more stone and metal, so let's go and do that. I think the I like the uh, the furthest uh, little substation thing. Seems like it's not looted as much. Oh, shotgun trap! <gasps> let's go. That's big. That's actually huge. No way. <laughs> yes. Okay, nice. Oh, I like this. Look at that, dude. Let's get some GP in here. Let me go recycle these um, flares. That's what I love about these the four-minute crate spawns. Those green crates can sometimes give you some really good stuff. that let's just go uh. <laughs> okay what do we get 20 okay that's enough for a few Woo. and my shells all right cool and 25 scrap it's looking good dude is that our first bit of low grade this entire white it is so for the compound bow, we need 245 scrap and obviously wood, metal frags and rope to make it. Um, that's going to be rather difficult. Okay, let's go. Shit. Oh my god. Oh, salvaged axe? Okay. I'll take that any day. There's 789 players online right now. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Dude, what is it with people in such low health? Uh, I'm gonna have to go again. What the? What's going on? Oh! Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god! I was on... Oh, it's those guys again. I'm gonna try and do a nighttime recycle run. Could be risky, but I need the metal, man. I, I need to upgrade the back of my base so we don't get flame raided. Mollied. Or, I'm surprised we haven't been mollied already. No, guys! I'm free! <laughs> Nighttime recycle complete. I think I might be able to upgrade. No, I don't think I'm going to. Um, uh, maybe. That's 80 more scrap though. That's kind of big. 204. That's not enough. It's pretty sure it's 300. I can do the door frame though. Because that's currently wood, isn't it? Oh, it's 100 for metal. I could do metal. Uh, I need the door frame as well. Let's do these walls so we don't get flame ready to instantly. Oh, it's 200. It is 200. Okay, I'm an idiot. <laughs> okay. Stone metal frame. Uh, door frame. And okay, we are good. We need one more wall, and then we'll actually be secure from a from a molly raid, which is my main priority right now. Let's go and farm these substations with the paddle and try and recycle at night time. Where is he? Where's his body? Oh damn! Right, let's go recycle. The paddle is so overpowered, man. I love it. <laughs> Let's go. We're getting a lot of scrap. I think we've already got enough scrap to go down the tier one work, uh, workbench for the cop bow. 353 scrap. I, yeah, I think we need 200, right? So that's one off the checklist for today. We just need that last bit. We've got sword as well. Compound bow. We've got, I think we've got enough to get water pipe. No, we need another 150 or 120. Uh, it's the morning of day number three now. 
We are almost completed the checklist. I just need this one ball. So we need another 200 metal frags. Or 200 or 300 stone. Um, it's proving to be rather difficult to get. Uh, I'm going to try and heal up as much as possible. Got a nail gun. Got to go in there and destroy someone who's loaded. That is the plan for today. Someone's already sneaked up. Like, there is so many people on the server. It's literally impossible to... How am I going to do this? I need to sneak. Like, I need to catch someone off guard. Oh, my. Hundred foot of hell frags. Let's go. Let's go. Uh. Okay, we're in. Nice. I'm almost there. Oh, got the barrow. Nice. Stick that up. Make things homely. Go! Oh! No way. <laughs> okay. This is scripted. Oh, that's huge. I need to research research that. That will be big in gas station. Oh, dude. Uh, how much scrap is it to research that? I think it's 125, so we're kind of close. That is big. Oh. <laughs> this guy, man. Recycle get out. 200 metal frags. Let's go. Let's go. You don't even need to finish. Let's go. I just want to upgrade so I don't get flame rated, dude. Okay. This is good. This is really big. Grab that hammer. And. Yeah, we can't get flame rated. Let's go. Pump. I don't know what that guy had. got yoka i think oh my god he had a water pipe oh oh solar panel oh oh okay nice solar panel could be huge man okay i feel quite good now i feel quite good we got a couple guns i mean a, a gun <laughs> uh we've got a couple some components we need to recycle a solar panel and battery so we could potentially set up like an electric system which is cool oh see what i mean uh, i literally just i was away for a second i haven't got a door anymore what the fuck uh okay <laughs> there are so many people outside Get rid of that bag. Oh god. Did he just jump down? See, what's he got? Uh. Oh no, I made a, a terrible mistake. <laughs> they might be my neighbors. Oh no. Um, okay, I need a new list. So that list has been completed. We've got a sheet metal door. We've got a full, like, kind of secure inner core to the base. Uh, I'd like to upgrade this part and put a sheet metal door on here next. I think that might be the smartest thing. And then eventually I'd like a second floor so we can actually think about putting, like, electronics and stuff when we get, when we get it, that is. As day number three started to end and my sanity was starting to dwindle, I ended up just spending the night door camping-ish in Oxums. But what did we learn from day number three? We learned that I have a neighbor just outside of the zone, so there's literally nothing I could do about it. And somebody already tried to raid me. Very lucky that we got that sheet metal door down. And as day number four came around, 
my priorities changed. I think my plan for today is to get guns. My priorities today is to make sure I've got enough weapons to fight with. Um, and I kind of want to expand a little bit of the base, which I actually have enough wood. I didn't realize I had that much wood. Um, so let's try give ourselves a little bit of an extra wiggle room here. room i could put some more stuff here I could probably put a shotgun trap there it's probably way more efficient uh yeah there we go okay nice uh how much wood do, do i have enough wood to build up yeah i do let me go do that we have a hatchet oh i do should i go and hatchet some stuff to get my own wood e probably I love how, like, doing stuff like this, you have to be so resourceful. Like, usually I would just throw away all the cans. But doing this challenge, I'm like, I'm keeping everything, dude. <laughs> Nothing's going to waste. I'm sorry, but it had to happen. <laughs> Uh, is there any trees? I can't go that way. Can I farm this tree here? Or just about. What the fuck? Oh, oh my god, it's silenced. Oh god. That was close. Oh my god. A rocket raid? Um, That might be my neighbors getting raided. That will be huge if it is. What is going on outside my base? I heard someone farming with a paddle. I hate to be that guy, but I need to loot. <laughs> Military box, please. Ooh, electric furnace. Yo, I need to take that home. That could be very nice to have. I do have a solar panel. I could set that up. Not that I have any uh, metal ore. <laughs> nice. I've organized the loot. This is what we're dealing with so far. Uh, it's not massively impressive, but we do have quite a few pipes, which is good when I research DB. Do I have enough scrap? Research table is... 200 metal fragments. Oof. Okay. Let's go and recycle some stuff. I think that is 200 metal frags by itself. Let's go try and recycle it. I think they got raided. Or they're like repairing or something. we go uh so i can make a research table nice and then we could research db which is awesome how many gears do i have if i can find one more gear we could think about making a vending machine try and sell stuff like beginner stuff for like just raw materials like metal frags and wood and stone because otherwise i'm not gonna be able to get any <laughs> All right. Oh, dear. okay. Let's go try and find another gear. Oh, look at that, dude! Straight away, let's go. Two gears. Can you just come out of the recycler? Shit. 
don't want to die to these saw guys. Pretty sure one of them just went down. Oh, I can't go out there. Okay, we have the gears for a vending machine. That is awesome. I think I'm being door camped. Yeah. Cool, I'll drop down. Drop down. <laughs> you survive? Yeah, that guy's a chad. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna try and do a big recycle run. This is gonna go bad. Uh, I feel like the server is calming down a little bit as the day goes on, which is nice. Get out of here. Oh, 151 metal frags. That's big. Oh, and another crate. Oh, my days. Just spawn all the time. I can't even come and counter that raid. Or, like, do anything with it. It's just out of the zone. How frustrating. Oh, my God. They just got deet. <laughs> At least I don't have to worry about my neighbors anymore. Okay. Um... What can I do with a vending machine? If I make one, because I can, don't think I can profit from it yet. I need, like, I need more wood. What is going on over there, bro? <laughs> Let's go farm those trees. Because I need to make, like, the front part of my base, you know what I mean? Is there any other trees that I can farm? Oh, no. <laughs> How far can I go? Oh, the group goes quite far. I might be able to get these trees here. Nice. You know what I could make now? Double barrel. Okay, let's try and see if we can make something of this. Oh my god. Let's go. <laughs> this is a big hole, dude. <laughs> oh god. Please let me up. I've got no... <laughs> I've got no ammo left. Nice. That's a really big hole. <gasps> nearly 500 scrap. Yo, that's crazy. And another. That's my DB. I'm an idiot. Ooh, scary. I seem to have a collection of binoculars, and I don't know why. <laughs> I don't have any other shells. That's a problem. Do I have any sulfur? I do. Uh, 50. Uh. Okay, so I can't really use the DB anymore until I can somehow get my hands on some sulfur. But I'm not sure how to do that. I'm thinking once I've built the, the front of the base, I'll plonk a vending machine down and then just start selling like basic stuff for uh, sulfur and metal. Okay, I need wood. And there's only one forest I can farm it in. Nice. Uh oh. 
Oh, God. Because I could only farm trees in the one grid that I was allowed to go in, I was often left with zero trees left to farm. But after a short while, I eventually had enough for a door, the vending machine, and the rest of my base. So I put the vending machine down and started to think of ideas of how I could make a profit. And so begins day number five. I think the morning is coming. Uh, it's day number five. So I need to think about what I could sell. What can I actually even craft? Um, so DBs and water pipes, I can craft. But what do I sell them for? I really desperately need raw materials like stone. So I'm thinking I can make like, oh, I make nail guns. I could sell those. Chip pickaxe. So tech trash for, I'm just going to do metal ore. Because I really need like metal. Let's do like 500 metal ore. Uh, we'll do a hatchet for stone. 300 stone. Nah, because it costs 75 metal and wood. Let's do metal ore. I'm really hoping that I can get this furnace up and running. That's what I'm banking on. Like 250 metal ore for a hatchet. Pickaxe the same. 500 wood for a crossbow. Seems pretty reasonable. Alright, now that's done. I think we should probably get the furnace ready to go so we need the solar panel on the roof where is it okay let's stick this on the roof all right cool we've got a furnace that's good uh do we have anything to cook in the furnace is the question uh 50 metal on some sulfur <laughs> It's not a lot, but it might eventually um, work out to be something. All right. Uh, okay. So we should probably just focus on making stuff for the vending for the vending machine. Yeah. Um, so we need to go get some more wood. So, so compound bow. Make two of those. Somebody's farming outside. I feel like this entire wipe has, has been me constantly, like, just above water. Like, in the fact of how much stuff that I've got. I'm just above being absolutely, like, naked with nothing. really need to get oh, is there an airdrop right there that's annoying uh i'm gonna sit at the top of the gas station and try and pick someone off with this compound bow because i really need to get myself an actual weapon uh because i'm oh military crate please give me a saw a python or saw please please oh these pipes okay i'm gonna wait here I need some stuff, dude. I'm down bad. <laughs> it's day number five and I'm still down bad. What is this? <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Come on. How far am I away from Revy? 320 scrap away. Do I? Oh my. This whole time. <laughs> Water pipe. We don't have any sulfur though. How are we going to get sulfur? I literally have 50 sulfur. And 67 charcoal. Can I make any bullets? I think I can make a rev. But I don't know if I can make any bullets. Make two revolvers. Nice. Nice. Maybe I sell one. I keep one. Who knows? Okay, we got a few bullets. We have to make this work, man. Right. 12 bullets. And a dream. We just want to kill a dude who's like juiced, you know? Nothing has sold yet. Come on. Give me a juice, dude. 
in my grid. That is not juice. I've only got seven bullets plus the eight in my gun, so. Cluster on the floor? Take that. I haven't actually been to this side of my grid yet. Like this way. Oh, we got a zip line. I blood out. I don't, don't have enough oh, uh, ammo for this. How am I going to get sulfur, man? Yeah, it's a bit too loud, babe. Actually, no, it's alright. It's alright, don't worry. Oh, military crate, military crate, please. Please, 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 please. Ha <laughs> oh, come on. We will get lucky one day. Oh. That was a very nice kill. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> As time went on, I found myself with less and less to do. With only a select amount of things in the area that I could actually use, there wasn't really much of a choice. I'd go to Oxum's, farm all the barrels, recycle, maybe PvP if there was somebody there. But other than that, there wasn't really much to do. I found myself bored, which isn't really surprising considering I'm locked to one grid and one monument in a game that has a lot to offer. But nevertheless, I carried on and pushed through. I kept farming all the different substations and all the barrels and stuff with military crates if I was lucky to just get as many metal fragments in the base as I could, thinking that eventually I could upgrade my entire base to metal and call it a day. I think I could make a tier two. Oh my god, I could make a workbench level two. Uh, okay. Okay, big upgrade. My trophy, I forgot about that. Workbench level two. All right, so we could start really gaming now. Uh, that's a lot of scrap. Uh, we get a thousand scrap, we could get down. Get saw, two thousand scrap. Holy mother of scrap, that's a lot of scrap, dude. Uh, okay, um, it's cool that we've got the opportunity now, though. We can start learning some proper BPs. I've got one more. Wait, 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 there we are. Day, I think next day is day six, and then the day after that is day seven. So we've got two more days to try and make something here. I think the, the plan for tomorrow is we need to somehow like find a node. <laughs> How much is a turret, by the way? 400 scrap. I can get 400 scrap. I might give myself the one trip to outpost. As like a, a a chance card, you know that once the one time card, just to buy an auto turret. But the problem is I've got no sulfur or anything to fill it with ammo. But it would be very funny to have. Holy! God. How long you been standing there for? What the hell? <laughs> Let me jump. Well, it begins day number six, I believe. Oh, what the fuck? The hell did he come from? He just stole all my stuff, didn't he? I hate my life. <laughs> I don't know, ammo man. Come on. No! 
Like, what the f It has come to my attention that we are down horrifically bad. <laughs> we are down so bad. <laughs> Six rust days in and I'm still crafting bows. Do you know what's you know it's a bad wipe when that's happening? <laughs> oh my god. These guys. Who are they? Who are they, man? That was my only shell. Who are these guys? Oh, whoa, oh. what the fuck? <laughs> I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to do this anymore, dude. Uh, <laughs> oh, one more day. One more day. Come on. Uh, next time I do this, I want to be locked to a decent monument. Something like Airfield. I think that'll be fun. Let me know in the comments if uh, that's something that you'd be interested in. This is painful. And I am miserable. <laughs> oh, can you survive in the one grid of Oxum's gas station? Yeah, you can. Can you survive happily? No, you can't. <laughs> A satchel? I mean, I can't really use that. <laughs> I can't farm any sulfur. Uh... Not quite sure what to do with that. Maybe I just sell it for sulfur or something. Oh, it's got a DB here. I'm scared. I recycle it. No! Got slugs? Holy! Ah! Oh, I don't know what to tell you, boys. I am uh, considering being completely donezoed. I don't think I can survive seven days. I genuinely don't. I am done. This is the most horrific rust experience that I have ever had, um, and I don't want to ever do it again. <laughs> it's horrible, man. This sucked. I want to be able to go and explore. Being locked to one grid is very, very boring. Uh, and painful for the soul, alright? But we got to a tier 2. That's kind of good. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed this. And uh, I'll see you in the next one, I guess. Hopefully this has been a good video. I don't know. Anyway. Peace out, boys. Goodbye. I'm going to go and commit.